Hello my lovelies and welcome to another vlog. Today's vlog is about most comfortable flat shoes. I have top 10 here. I'm going to talk today about Gucci, Ferragamo, Acne Studios, Stella McCartney, Cuccinelli, I guess. So that's it. <laughs> and let's start this video uh, with my favorite brand, as you know, guys, for sure. If you're watching my channel, of course, you know that this is the brand Gucci. <laughs> and uh, I'd like to start today with uh, loafers in burgundy color. Just look at them. They are so beautiful, lovely. I like this horse bead detail in gold and uh, I um, was thinking like well would it be kind of not too obvious to show you this pair of shoes because like who doesn't have them but then I thought like probably not everyone because first of all it's uh, kind of very expensive uh, pair of shoes I recently checked prices on the official Gucci website and I saw that the price of it is $830 why do I want to speak about this topic is because I think that this pair of shoes is worthy of investment because it's classic it's uh, not something that is going to be tomorrow out of fashion not like kind of seasonal collection uh, this uh, stays forever this is always trendy always comfortable and uh, the other cool thing is that, that here you can put it down in case you know like it's a whole day and you damaged your feet already with wearing it like that so you can always put it down and keep using them how cool is it <laughs> i think it's really great because um i have constantly this uh kind of problem because i have very thin and sensitive skin so like it's easily getting damaged but then when i learned that there is a pair of shoes so that i can just put it down i became very happy uh, in fact that's why i bought later another pair of shoes uh, gucci without back part and this pair of shoes is called women's princetown leather slipper it also has this a uh, horse bit detail in front which i like a lot uh, i don't like new logo that they have uh, i don't know if you understand what i mean i will insert picture here i don't like that this kind of logo i like this classic kind of horse bead it's much more elegant i like it a lot considering currency exchange especially in relation to real or rubble which are my currencies <laughs> to buy a uh, gucci becomes more and more difficult but i think if you buy princetown leather slipper it's a really really cool investment for me uh, it makes total sense because I live in Brazil and as you know guys it's very hot here so but in the evening it becomes fresh so basically every single evening besides those when it's raining heavily I can use them when I go to Russia if it's spring or autumn or summer like I again can use it all the time it's only winter when we have it really really cold so another thing is that this piece is not going to be out of fashion and uh, you can uh, use it in any country it's not too flashy it's not kind of silly looking doesn't have any kind of butterflies and flowers and so on so far guys and uh, next pair of shoes is uh, white sandals kind of off white uh, sandals uh, with a double g g logo here in front also in gold i like a lot uh, this model but honestly speaking i kind of like in here uh, a small hill like they are extremely comfortable but I think small heel is really kind of needed to, to have the right position of your feet. We used them recently in Argentina. We went to, to Argentina and I shot plenty of vlogs from Argentina. I'll insert here link on the playlist from Argentina so that you can click and watch it because that was amazing, like uh, excellent trip. I was also so happy and I shot 
uh, nice places, nice outfits for you guys. So like just click here and watch it. Now let's uh, move to another type of shoes. They just uh, like the brand. And uh, even when we lived in uh, Italy and we could buy any, any brand because, you know, in Italy you can buy anything you want. We always went for Gucci because price was more realistic and because I find shoes up to my style, up to my taste. And again, very comfortable. And out of all of what I have, I usually put on Gucci. So, sorry. So guys, so this is a women's AK sneaker with a B. And this is the house's classic low top sneaker and it's embellished with a gold embroidered B against the green and red web. And I also wanted to mention about B, guys. B is an archival code first introduced in Gucci ready to wear in 1970. So I spoke about uh, B in another video about uh, Gucci print and there was showing scarves and there was one of the scarves with a B, with a golden B and I also mentioned that. that they have uh, plenty of different patterns and the other one that I'd like to buy and to have a third one is the one with the B. Why with the B? Because the B is a uh, so different model. I'll show you here what type of Arca sneakers uh, do they have because they have different designs here. Uh, recently they uh, even had with a Disney <laughs> but I find it really crazy. I prefer something more classic, something kind of which is not going to be tomorrow out of fashion. That's why I decided to go for a golden bee because I think like next year and year after it's still going to be on trend. And uh, as all the other AK sneakers, these ones behind are red and green. And I find it very cool. <laughs> That's it, I find them also very comfortable and as you see, probably you can see that I really use them. It's already losing a little bit of leather here on the sides, on the back, but what to do? I prefer to buy and use it and buy and just remove dust from the shoes. Shoes must be worn, enjoyed. That's it. And let's move to the last pair of shoes from Gucci. Okay guys, so the next pair of shoes is a Gucci logo shoes. They write name Women's Right and Gucci Logo Leather Sneaker. Uh, these particular sneakers I use every single time I travel. I love them so much. They have a, a thicker sole and uh, as you see it's a very thick and uh, bulky construction kind of ugly shoes. You remember they were uh, very trendy on so here, uh, Louis Vuitton ugly shoes. Everyone was getting crazy buying them. And then I thought like, well, I think this Louis Vuitton is going to be out of fashion very soon. And I went and I bought this pair of shoes in Gucci. It's still not out of fashion. They keep relaunching and relaunching and relaunching again and again. Uh, this one is a classic piece and uh, they also relaunched with the Disney characters. I'll insert here some different models so that you can have a look. Which prints uh, do they have there on uh, their official website? Have them a little bit dirty, <laughs> sorry for that. But um, I constantly bring them, you know, for some kind of uh, dry cleaning for shoes. I don't know if it makes sense for you. So like I bring and uh, to, to shoemaker and they do professional cleaning and hydration and like that I manage to keep them in a good condition for years. I think these uh, sneakers stayed with me for something like uh, two slash three years, something between that lines because I bought while we were living in Rome. So something like two and a half years. Um, and I, I'll keep using them because they're still kind of trendy. I saw some influencers using them and I thought, good choice. Okay, guys, the next pair of shoes is Acne Studios. <laughs> I'm sorry, <laughs> falling down, they're kind of heavy. I like this pair of shoes a lot. I bought them before pandemic when I was in Portugal. And, uh, kind of 
uh, that was the purchase kind of i i got several pair of pairs of shoes i got uh Stella mccartney i got the sacna studios and uh, something else i don't remember already and i was thinking like i'll order i'll have a look and i'll choose one pair of them for myself in the end all of them stayed because i just couldn't choose i liked all of them model i like more so i got all of them okay guys let's keep going with another brand ferragamo that i love deeply uh, there was uh, that video about uh, top five luxury shoe brands that i shot for you and spoke about Ferragamo. I'm going to talk about top five brands of shoes that I love a lot and wear a lot but I didn't show you this pair of shoes. I love this um, pastel pink color shoes. Currently pastel color like pastel pink, pastel green, pastel blue trend. So to let you know if you see something pastel buy it for yourself because this is current trend and um, i like a lot of this romantic bow in front and the low heel guys and the next brand i'd like to talk to you about is brunello cuccinelli brand brunello cuccinelli started his colored cashmere knitwear for women in salameo in 1978 the market above all the german speaking one showed a huge interest and appreciation for his unprecedented proposition and this allowed his company to quickly emerge. Brunello Cuccinelli managed to create a cashmere garment that would last forever. High quality pieces that you would never throw away. If you buy anything in Brunello Cuccinelli boutique, you may pass it on to your children as its ability to last is the symbol of Brunello Cuccinelli's value. And now guys, let me show you the sneakers that I have from this brand. In case you got interested, so they are available on my Teresa website. Um, I'll leave the link below this video. Next brand I'd like to talk to you about is Stella McCartney. Love this bulky construction, very comfortable shoes, use them a lot everywhere in every country. And I like that I can put them and remove them easily. I'll leave a link here somewhere on top that you can click and watch unpacking video black sneakers just look at that just look at them all of the brand another pair of shoes that i got in stella mccartney is this white pair of shoes there was another video about the sneakers when i did unpacking i'll leave a link on top of the screen so that you can click and watch it the material Please write me in comments, what's the name of this material? I love them, very comfortable, love the bulky construction, high sole, everything. Okay guys, so that's it for today. Uh, this was my video about uh, top 10 uh, most comfortable flat shoes. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did shooting it for you. If you watched uh, the entire video until this very moment, please put me the MNG of sneakers <laughs> down there in the comments below. Don't forget to put like in case you liked this video, subscribe on my channel and uh, see you in the next vlog. Thank you. Bye guys.